once the lineup has been completed, reviewed, all the printouts have been done, the final step will be to create the exports of your team entries and your full team roster. These will be created each week for lineup exchange with the other team, whether you're the home team or the away team. To create these export files, we will go to File and select Export Meet Entries. Note, we can export this file to any des destination on the drive, whether it be the hard drive or a flash drive on your computer. You can select whichever drive you prefer, whichever directory you prefer. Make sure when you do this, select the meet that you're working on. Make sure you don't have a prior meet or a future meet with no entries in it. Also make sure that the export relays feature is included. You should always make sure that the do not include entry times box is not checked. This will make sure that all of the meet reports that are printed out Include your swimmers' best times, so when they're looking at heat sheets or meet entry reports, they'll be able to see what their best time is in that event. So they'll know exactly during the meet whether or not they've co competed at a best time. Once all these criteria have been selected, click OK, and it creates an entry file sent to this destination, this folder. The file will be named the team abbreviation dash GA dash entries. And if there are multiple entry files in the computer, it will sequentially number them from smallest to largest, with the larger numbers being the later files. Click OK, and your meet entries file has been exported. The other export file that you'll need to create for your lineup exchange will be the roster. In order to do this, we'll go to File, Export, Athlete Teams. This will create an export file that includes not just the swimmers entered in the meet, but your entire swim team, whether the swimmers were entered in the meet or not. The reason for doing this is to allow teams to use any swimmers that were not entered in the meet as substitutions when you get to Meet Manager, without having to re-enter those swimmers' athlete information into Meet Manager to get them entered in the meet if you have a situation where they're needed. So again, we create this export file. We can send this to any destination on your computer, flash drive, hard drive, whichever folder you like. You can leave all these boxes pretty much blank. I would include your inactive swimmers just as a, just in case, in case you accidentally made a swimmer inactive. You can include contact and group information if you like, but leave all the other boxes blank. Once you've done that, click OK, and again, this many athletes have been exported to this destination on your computer. There's the file name, the team abbreviation, dash GA, dash roster, 001, 002, and so on. Once that's done, click OK, and you're good to go for the lineup exchange. 